What's going on y'all? Welcome back to the channel. So I want to talk about one thing and I had this guy reach out to me because he was like, dude, I'm in a bad spot when it comes to money. So I had my video that came out yesterday, the day before yesterday, something like that. I've been running around doing a lot of stuff and and I'm honestly constantly busy all the time. But this guy reached out to me and I read it and he, uh, he reached out to me on Instagram and he was like, dude, like this is almost embarrassing trying to like tell you about my situation, but this is what it is. And the dude was was you know, it's almost like he didn't know how to even reach out to me or how to talk to me or how to, you know, say something to me in order to help him out because they think he was so ashamed or so afraid of what I would even say to him. Um, and this is the problem today with people. I don't mean you who reached out to me. I mean, with, with, with people who, who are already, you know, doing well, now, I want to tell you from where I'm sitting, uh, there are a lot of people who are, you know, who don't care about doing well for themselves and they don't really care about going that extra level, going that extra step. But however, what, I, what, what, what I've also noticed is there's people who do want to go to that extra step, that extra level, but they are scared to reach out because they're so ashamed or so afraid of whatever. I want to tell you guys something. There is nothing wrong with being in the situation that you're in as long as you're trying to get out. Now, if you're in a situation and you're complaining and you're whining and you're not trying to pull yourself out, then of course it's your problem, right? But I, I felt I felt heartbroken for this guy because he was so ashamed and so like he beat himself up a lot. And that's why I made my other channel. Uh, you can probably find it by Daily Vibration, but I changed it just to my name, Kyle Johnson. So you can look that up. And that's why I'm talking about mindset over there. I haven't released the video in, in like almost a week and a half, I think. But I talk about mindset over there and how you're supposed to think and how you're supposed to try to be before you become wealthy and rich because there's a certain mindset that it takes. The blogging stuff that I do every single day and the video stuff that I got into years ago and, and stuff like that, it's just, it's the same sort of stuff that you do every single day. The problem with Make Money Online right now is there's so many different ways. But here's the thing, they all work. Dropshipping works. Amazon FBA works. Blogging works, YouTubing works, all of it works. You just have to stick to it for five years or longer. Sometimes you get lucky like I did and you get successful earlier. My personal belief is everything is energy. You put a lot of energy into something, a lot of emotion. Why do you need to get out of this situation? What's that? Like, say you're going to be homeless like two months from now. You know, the, what that feeling, right? A attach that to the need to work hard. And I think that's where the real authenticity comes out and that's why a lot of people like my content some people don't like it but whatever that's where people can really relate to me and and they can see that i i mean business i, I don't talk bullshit like i teach you what i do of course you got to invest yourself right so don't ever be ashamed about where you are in life as long as you try to move forward and make progress that is me man to man from me to you because yes, I'm younger than a lot of people who reach out to me, especially the ones that are like, you know, oh my God, this guy's younger. It's kind of like an ego thing, right? It's okay. You can always make a, 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 a you can always do a 180, right? And change your life completely if you're going in a, in a bad direction. But most of the time, all you got to do is make a small adjustment, a small mindset shift and learn a couple of new skills and bam, your entire life has changed. So what do I always teach? Money follows value, right? This follows value. That follows value. Relationships follow value. So you have to deliver value at scale. Well, where are the people? Google, right? Google and YouTube. They have an algorithm designed to deliver value to people. That is their, that is their business model. How do we deliver searches to people? You can so fucking easily create a 10K a month business, 5K a month business, 15K, whatever you decide. In two to three to five years, depending on your uh, effort, your energy, like I told you, right? Energy and your emotions. And you put that into your work and you will move forward. I don't know what it is really about the emotional part. There's something in the subconscious realm or whatever that helps move that needle forward a little bit more when you really want it. There are people who really want something and, and they, they can fucking feel it in their gut, right? That is how I think a lot of luck comes is you move that energy, that emotion, you move shit on that side of things. I don't know how it works, but it works. When I first started this YouTube channel, I was boom, broke, right? I was moving everything forward at the same time and I needed to make a full-time income online. And this was the first place that gave me the full-time income online. 
and then it all started sort of happening together. When I really needed it, it happened. But what I think happens to people is when they get to that place, they get to the place where they're comfortable, they're not in that energy anymore. They're not in that pocket that they need to be. And it's sort of like a desperation thing. So Tony Robbins, I think, said this, people do things out of inspiration or desperation. And it's 100% true. Because when you're desperate, that energy, you know what it feels like. A lot of you guys know what it feels like. And then you're inspired to do things. And that's where I am at now, where I'm inspired to help people. I'm inspired to enlighten and encourage and help push the needle forward a little bit more for you guys. So don't ever be afraid to say something. Someone will listen to you eventually. Again, it's just like, it's just, you're, you have to, you're going to make an impact or a dent no matter, you have to just keep pushing forward. There is, there are two courses that you can reach out to, that you can take that you're, that you're ever, ever going to need. And you can reach out to me. Yes, they're expensive, but they're only one time and they have communities and they have um, updated the, sorry, they get updated. So you don't need to worry about like any recurring bullshit. It's just one time for both courses. There is another one that you can take that is that is a, a, a subscribe like a monthly subscriber thing, but I haven't gone through it yet. I've gone the, through the other two courses all the way through, but this new one I haven't gone through it yet. I do not want to promote something that I have not gone through and vetted myself, but that is what I'm doing now. And that's only a $40, $50 a month subscription that teaches you a whole bunch of crap too. So it's pretty badass. My coaching is still the same. I can still point you in the right direction, but I'm more of a guide right? When it comes to that stuff and saying, okay, do that. I'll take a look at your site. I'll do all the stuff that, you know, because when those courses are done and you're going to have questions, everyone does, you're going to want someone to turn to. And the communities aren't always enough. You can reach out to me in the voicemail or a call. I can say, oh, I'll take a look at it. And I can point, oh, this is ugly. Change that. Oh, this is different. Change that. You know what I mean? Just dumb shit. But what my, this, the message of this video, what I want it to be is don't ever be afraid to to feel the way that you are feeling and don't let it paralyze you move forward forward progress make dents in the universe right do shit eventually you're going to crack the code eventually and you're going to start making whatever you want to make really and then when you have money you know make the right decisions with it you know nothing's ever you know, everything, especially when you're an entrepreneur is kind of, actually life is risky. Working for a corporation is just as risky. It really is, right? You're at the mercy of some corporation that's just, you know, one scandal away from losing all their money. You know what I mean? You never know. So take that with what you will. This really isn't a relationship video. Obviously it's different. It won't get many clicks and views, but people who do watch it, I just want you guys to know that there are people out there who give a shit. The reason why rich people or wealthy people turn themselves off to the world is because it is, it's hard to, it's really hard to get people to think and believe the, the way that you do. Um, they, you need to want it yourself. You really need to have a why. Okay. Um, so if that's you reach out, I'll point you in the right direction and you'll be okay. You just need to work on it yourself. Okay.